What's going on, everyone? Kami here. And you remember how I went on the PTS and I played some Combat Medic and I was genuinely surprised about how well Combat Medic was performing? Well, we're on the same map, so I kind of have the same type of like positioning and stuff like that, so I remember that. We're gonna see how good Combat Medic is prior. Uh, I don't know if I have... I said we're really like Medicinal and Excellence. We don't have Medicinal and Excellence that high on here. No, we'll go ahead and just go Medic. This one has a pep in the, pep in the step, pep in the pip 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 long stock. But there was a decent amount of buffs that were coming in with the patch, so... You know. Wait, what? Oh no. I forgot I have a binding. Never mind, don't talk about it. I wanna talk about it. I gotta undo my macro. Ooh, ooh, ooh. They did get one of us. Oh, they got a lot of us. Don't worry about it. Woo -hoo -hoo. Oh, that was a wham that's a double whammy right there. We kept Crow alive, dude. Oh, I can't hit the shots. I can't hit the shots, Captain. Excuse me, pardon me. Trying to... Trying to not suck here. <laughs> oh, man, we kept Crow alive, dude. I am impressed with how much healing that pulled off. Oh, no. No! Oh, big hit, big hit, big hit. Oh, no. Oh, we're fine. We're fine. We're fine. We're fine. We're fine. We're fine. Objective has been lost, but do not do not fret, my young Padawans. I said, do not fret, for I am Pippi Man, Pippi Longstocking. Maybe. You slowed, fool. You slowed, fool. Ooh, gotta back off. Butterfly in the sky. I can go twice as high. It's in a book. Just uh oh. Just take a look. It's reading rainbow. Okay, guys. Okay. Oh, what did I really like on it? Deft hands. I really like deft hands. I was digging it. Ah, that's not gonna be able to hit. So we're gonna wait until. We're gonna wait until. Oh no. Trying to keep Crow alive. I was accidentally dodging Dingo like a boss. I wasn't even really. I kind of forgot. I thought he gave up on me because I wasn't getting hit for a little bit, but we've all been there. You know the hardest, the hardest to hit someone is when they're not looking at you because you have zero idea about what type of dodging they're gonna do. Ooh, look at that spray. Oh. Let's get some chronos too and uh see what we can do. That ult probably wasn't worth it. Maybe I could have ulted Dingo and killed him, but then like that's just stuff not happening to Dingo. Like, you know what I mean? Like it's not. Oh, it won't let me... Okay. This sucks, Becky. Okay, so we I thought we jumped up on the, the wall and we just kind of stayed on the ground. If we would have went up on the wall, we would have been in a much better situation and we might have just survived. What is what is happening here? What is Demon Pie doing? He's moving and grooving, my friend. Moving and grooving. Oh, bummer. Oh, so close. So close. Oh, hey, what's up? Oh, we stuck in here. But we gotta keep moving, though. Yeah, we don't care. We don't care about his uh, once more and him rising and whatnot. What is unloading on me, dude? Like, I know there's an Eevee coming in behind me. Oh, right, there's a Vivian on the other team. <laughs> uh, fly on oh, wait, Medicinal and Excellence. Oh, you know what? I need to make a new combat loadout. We got him. Oh, yeah. Can we kill that Vivian? Thank you. That's all we ever want to do in life is kill Vivian. You can't get me. I'm the gingerbread man. Okay, cool. We're cool. Attack? We're trying to. There's a Terminus in our spawn. <laughs> I have my mouse 4 usually bound to Q. So it allows me to... We'll get a heal over there. It usually allows me to... Oh. Use my Q when I when I'm like using certain uh what do you call it? 
Oh, almost able to get him. When we're using like abilities like potion where I need to do a little bit more aiming or grenade when I need to position, like if I want to strafe around the corner but then I want to hit Q, I'll use mouse forward. The problem is with Genshin, one of my biggest complaints is when you want to do like fast hit combos, you um you have to left click every single time because holding left click will do a power up attack. I hated that, dude. I hated it so much. Sorry, one second. Okay, I got my left hand sound. Booga booga booga. Uh oh. Okay, cool. We're in. We're passing judgment. Where's the Eevee? There she is. Booba doopa doo. Oh. That was a prolonged death right there. We knew it was coming, but we just had to wait for the Eevee to exhaust all the resources. Oh, yeah. But yeah, so I, I need to unbind my macro where my mouse forward button just holds left click or just get used to it, you know? Or just adapt, Kami. Come on. Okay, well, kind of giving up on that. Okay, there we go. Bombs away! Nope, never mind. Oh! I always forget about the internal cooldown or the global cooldown. Like right there, I tried to hit Q and then I immediately hit my F, F button, my left shift button to kind of to try to bounce up like a bunny and whatnot. Nah, the game was like, you can't do that yet. Silly goose. Darn. I wanted to kill Dingo. Probably should have healed in the middle of bouncing up and down like a like a ballerina or bunny, whatever I said. Yeah. Uh, but I will tell you this, I am genuinely surprised about how much he can heal right now. And this buff is just going to make him even better. I need to redo my loadout because I don't think I have a high enough medicinal and excellence. And this is kind of proof to me that there are times when I try to heal someone, I was like, I can heal them. I could definitely heal them behind a wall, but it wasn't enough. And we only have level three medicinal and excellence. So I have come to the conclusion that I prefer level four medicinal and excellence. If I plan on trying to get some heals, like if my primary job is to heal, we want to go medicinal and excellence. Pep in the step can probably drop down to one, uh, 6, 12, 8, and 24, so we're going to go down to 18% per movement. Maybe we drop Pep in the step, maybe we bump up Gift Giver to four, maybe we bump up Medicinal and Excellence to a five, and then just make this a one, and then change the Pep step. I don't know. I'll uh, I'll figure out what I'm going to do, and we will. Uh, I'll show you what I change. You know what's crazy is, at the end of that video, I said I'm going to change my loadout to up the blah, 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 blah. I was saying a lot of words, right? And then within five seconds, I had forgot that I needed to and join the next custom game. It's kind of scary how bad my memory is. But it doesn't matter because we do have Mega Potion build, which has level five medicinal next and it has level four reload. The only thing I don't like about this is acrobatic strip trick because we're not going to be hitting enemies that much, but that's fine. That's fine. I think the only thing that's really that important is medicinal excellence and, and reload. So we'll go ahead and go with that. We'll still go Kronos and then we'll start going like deft hands here in a little bit. Uh, and I still haven't disabled my macro. Impressive, Kami. Impressive. Like I said, we're going to get used to it. We're going to get used to it. We, we shot a wall. Did he say off my ride? I, I, I ask this every single time. Uh, Woohoo! Sowie! Time out! Gotta go! Woohoo! Okay. Ooh! Ooh, Panini, just stay alive! Panini! 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 I just, I prayed. I prayed so hard. Oh no, he moved. Flaps, he's too mad for me. Too mad, the madman says. Hanyang. That's going to put us back in combat, so we're going to need to use our Q. But we're not going to be able to touch the point. Like, we personally aren't going to be able to touch the point. But Panini might be able to. Panini did. Ah, bummer. We're probably going to get dropped here, so we'll go ahead and just accept this. Maybe try to take down Inferno while we're at it. Nope. No time for that. So a thing that I'm really noticing here is if we were to take Acrobatic's Trip down to a 1 and then get Gift Giver up to a 4, it'd be so nice. It'd be so nice right now. So a little bit sad. I said it wasn't going to matter that much, but honestly, uh, it kind of does. Because that extra healing would have been so nice. 
Go tear wash. And then we'll get some death tans here soon. Gotta go over here. Oh, ho, ho, ho. oh no, they're taking up the charge. It's too much for me, my friend. Yeah, death tans gonna feel super nice. Let's just try to slow them down a little bit. Get some heals on these big boys. We should be able to kill Summer here. Oh no. We should be able to get that kill. Oh, I fell. Graviton, I believe in you, buddy. Okay, nice, 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 nice. Pop a heal on you. Yep. Pop another heal on you. Pop a heal on Panini, because I'm assuming he's taking damage. I gotta pay attention a little bit more to the top right. Medicinal and excellence. Nope. Okay, we were just, we were wishful there. I honestly was just like, if I hit this, that's gonna be insane. And I didn't. Got him. That was a ballsy ult. He's still going. Did he live? That's a bummer. That is a bummer. We gotta kill those people right in their face area. Ooh, that hurt. All right, backing off. Peekaboo! <laughs> Can we kill this person? We're we just ignoring this Drogos. Drogos are people too, okay? Okay, Deft Hands 2. Oh, we're gonna try to make some things happen, Cap. We're gonna go to left side because they went left side last time. We're gonna try to get over here on this. Oh no. We're just dodging. This Drogos still trying to shoot me? No? Okay. I figured he's gonna take some damage. Okay. Yeah, he did. He took a lot of damage, dude. That's why I pre shot that heal. So I was just expecting a little bit of burst to hit him. That didn't heal? Man, I swear Medicinal and Excellence was uh, a little bit more. Holy guacamole. They just kind of let that happen, didn't they? Oh, man. We're at Medicinal and Excellence 5, man. And we're just not hitting them. I swear it used to be more. Uh oh. He's, 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 he's jumping around like a madman. Oh, no, 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 no. We fine, we fine. Yeah, we cool, dog. Kind of want to top him off, but nah, he's, he's good, he's good. This Deft Hands feels really nice, though. And I wish, I always say like Deft Hands on a loadout. I used to say Deft Hands on a loadout just felt really weird, but it, it just does so much more. Like the same thing for like Dredge loadout. Ooh. Oh. You know, where it like does more than just makes you reload faster. Oh, ho, ho, ho. Can we make this jump? Oh, we can't. That sucks. Oh, we tried to jiggle peek just to get that shot off, just to top off our Koga before Kotaray has got applied to him. And uh, we got punished. Why? Because we have giant heads. I mean, I can't stress this enough. This is the main reason why I do not. Let's go Deft Hands 3. Screw it. It's just going to feel hilarious. The reason why I don't play Pip a lot is because you, especially in casuals, you just don't know. That heal didn't hit. Man, I, I am interested. I am interested to see if that actually didn't hit, like we're on rewatch it. Cause I swear that blew up more than enough to be able to heal with Medicinal and Excellence. Cause I used to just think Medicinal and Excellence was just busted. Like it healed too much. Like the, the radius was just too big. Hey, what's going on? And now it's like they like fixed it or something. This should heal both. Okay. Oh, bummer. Alrighty then. Panini, I got you, bro. I got you, bro. We're gonna get our, we're gonna get our ult back up. We're gonna chill. Chilling like villains. And uh, see if we can make a final push, but like, no cot. Oh, there's a cot. Oh, Oh no, dude, the burst is coming. Oh, Panini's making it in. Panini didn't make it in. A Rommel, interesting. Really didn't want Graviton to live, but Graviton still lived. Summer was angry. OBKB. Deft Hands 3. Kronos 1. Where'd that mine land at? You guys see that mine flying? Where did it go? Okay, so now we definitely. Oh, oh see that hit? How'd that hit? You know what I mean? Back. 
Oh no. Okay, got him. Oh no. This is bad. Yep, I knew that was gonna happen. Bummer. We have our ultimate up though, so we can try to retake this, but this might be the end here. I mean, it's definitely not over, definitely not over. Uh, I've got an ult, Barrick's got an ult. I don't think Barrick's an ult, he's gonna try to stay alive, he's gonna chill. He doesn't have a healer right now, he probably shouldn't push in right now. He's also 75% head hitbox, so center class was just like, I got you. Do we, you know, just screw this. Okay, we got him. Like, geez, Louise, man, just take him down. But Rom's tanky. There's no time for that. Ghost, Ghost, he couldn't take down. It, it, that's too much to ask. I wasn't, I wasn't helping that much. He open. I was just getting, I was getting alive. That's not cool, bro. We're gonna sprint right on there. I don't know if overtime's gonna proc. Oh, overtime did proc. Too much heals, no cauterize, because we had deft hands. This is why you buy cauterize in this game. You buy cauterize. You don't buy deft hands, but like, you know, we're not supposed to be doing damage, so buying cauterize with with a combat medic pip is probably a pretty bad idea. Know what I'm saying, player, player. Not a good plan. We've got combat mechanic. No. no, I just can't. I can't hit, like from a, from an uppercase or from a lower, we got it, we got it, Coolio. But from a situation where we couldn't aim down at the ground at all, and he was juking like that, yeah, it's absolutely impossible to heal that. Unless we were gods, which we aren't gods. But he should be juking like that, you know what I mean? Like, not like he shouldn't be. That's a bummer. The charging is being tooketh. Fair enough. We went ahead and grabbed Cauterize, and by Cauterize, I mean we went for Kronos. Full mare. See, that heal hit, man. It hit. Where's that Drogo side? Is he, like, over here, right? Yeah. Uh-oh. Can't move! Oop, nope, hold on. Oh, ah, ghosty! For the love of God, let me heal! <laughs> I just couldn't get around him. He just always was on top of it. Insane. But now I want to heal ghosty. Now I want to heal ghosty. Just shoot in the ground. Pew, pew. That's how you play right there. Pew, pew, pew. Okay. Do, 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 do. Mm. okay, we're set, we're set, we're set. Oh, we're pushing for it. I just need to get around this corner. Got him, got him. Okay, cool. Oh, sometimes these splash damage for the heals too don't seem to come up when, they, when I expect them to. Where did, oh, Flapsy barely surviving. <laughs> These heals are just not enough, man. 175 heals feels bad, man. Oh, there's a person behind me. <laughs> Got some heals on Flapsy. Yep, okay. Take that, Ghosty. Ghosty, Ghosty. You know, whenever I think of Ghosty, I think of... There's this guy who played Spellbreak, and his name was Ghosty something? I don't know. He was insane, though. He was insane. He definitely... He streamed He streamed on the side just like a part-time or whatever. That's how I started off, too, by the way. If you guys ever plan on streaming, make sure you stream part-time. Don't go full-time right away because it's a saturated and hard-as-hell market to grow into. But anyway, also make YouTube videos first. That's how you get exposure and how you get discovered. Don't just stream. It's not worth it. Check out Alpha Gaming if you guys want to know how to stream. It's, it's good. But anyway, whenever I think of Ghosty, I think of, I think of them, and I just, I'm just imagining them pulling up like an ice call and just sniping people from across the map. God, he was, he had sick flicks. It made me realize like, man, I wish I wasn't so about tracking and having lower sensitivity. I wish I was just like a showman with fast sense and got used to it. <clears throat> but I'm pretty sure my carpal tunnel would, it would be speed rocketed by like a million miles per hour. I can't help there. Oh no, big ying heals, but we're capturing the point though. Catalyst pip! Hello. Game? I'm back, I'm back, I'm back. Where is he? Okay. I just wanna thank you for the heals. I gotta heal, gotta heal. We got the payload! We did it! We gotta aim. Drogos? Oh my goobers. Oh my goobers. Infernal Saris has paused it. JMMP sitting at one life. What will happen? Well, nothing. We capture the payload. We'll be right back. Here we go. We're back. And I can't hit the shot. 
We hit the shot. Panini was at one live. He was he was giving me encouraging words. And then I just let him die. That's a bummer. Think we lose this? Yeah. Catalyst Pip versus uh, Combat Medic Pip. You lose that. I'm assuming, I'm assuming Infernal has Cauterize, yeah. We picked up one level of Cauterize. Not that mandatory. Honestly, like, probably not suggested in general. But I like having a little bit of Cauterize if I do plan on, like, hitting somebody. Just having that one, one level of Cauterize stacking on there just feels really nice. Oh, got you, buddy. Gotta go. <laughs> Alright, cool, 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 cool. That caught race helped, guys. Come on. You know it did. Well, uh, there we have Pip being Pip as a demonstration of uh, Pip being Pip. You're welcome. I tell you, man, sometimes you just get those sick games, like those sick fights. You come out with one life. You feel so proud. You feel the pride and accomplishment. And then, like, whoa. And then a sniper just peeks around the corner and goes, you're dead. And I'm like, well, that was, that's not very nice. Oh no, we missed a shot. That sucks. We got the kill on the pip though. We slowed them down. That's what's important. Now the question is, can Panini stay alive for me to get up there fast enough? I wonder what you think as a person, just in general. Like imagine you're playing, a, like imagine you're in the realm, right? And you're just like, man, I really wish I could get some heals. And you just see like, boom, and you just feel your whole body reverberate from all the damage being done to you. And then, oh, okay. Never mind. That was my battle staying out of the middle of the open. But you feel like just explosions on you. And it probably hurts like hell. But Pip's like laughing on the background. He's like, it's fine. I'm healing you. It's you're good. Just keep going. <laughs> all right, we got ourselves Resilience 2. I think Resilience 3 might have been a better play. Instead of getting cauterized, that is. Got him topped off. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. Amani's low. I don't know where the Amani's at. Oh, no. We're not paying attention to Panini too much. Oh, uh, we might expect an ult here in a second. Oh, never mind. We're good. Oh, 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 we're trying to hit him. Wait for that cod fall off. Cool. Big, big, big uh, heal burst there. Did we kill him? I think we did. Ooh, keep running over here. Thank you. Yes. Yes. We're good. Where are you going? Oh no, I'm healing the dragon. I want to shoot the person. I can't. I don't want to heal the dragon. Can I heal? Can I heal the dragon? <laughs> okay, I'm not healing the dragon. I actually, might be able to take down. Nice, nice. That's huge. Resilience too. Let's see if it's enough. No, not enough to save. There's a Knessa, so we need to hide. Oh, the heal wasn't enough. But the win was enough. We did. 43,000 damage. I mean, honestly, maybe a little bit too much damage coming out from us. But hey, we were able to keep up. Was that life exchanging? We were able to keep up with the life exchanging. I think I've been sleeping on combat medic for way too long. And he might have a little bit of issues here and there. But I think he's legit. As long as they fix his freaking hitbox, dude. His head hitbox. It sucks, though, because, like, people don't realize this. People were talking about Paladin Strike. Remember that mobile game? <laughs> Whatever. Uh, had such sweet skins. It was, it was because it was a mobile game. And it didn't really matter about, like, aiming and headshots. So everything could be wonky and have these cool, like, accents here and there. Whereas in this game, if you have something that's massive, but the hitbox is much smaller than the than the actual visual design of the, of the character, you really feel it. You know, you're like, I swear I shot them. But I'm trying to think about, I think Rogue Company had the, had the chick with the pony tell or something where you could see the head sticking up or maybe it's overwatch maybe it's this game i don't know but you can always see the head sticking up over his area but you can you can see the head you can shoot the head like the hair popping up but you can never hit the person and that's that was a little bit frustrating for players and i don't know if that ever got fixed but anyway uh with this game pip just has a massive head and it doesn't matter what skin you're using they just need to change his hitbox because you can't just like lower the hitbox to where it's like more tight because that would be weird like what if you hit him in the chin and you don't get a headshot that would be frustrating but pip would maybe look weird with a little a tinier head i don't know though i don't know maybe that's that's part of his design. Before we call it a day, 
and I say thanks for watching or whatever. Hope you enjoyed it. Thanks for watching. No, what do I say? I don't remember what I say. I'll see you next time. There we go. That, there it is. I'm the worst, dude. Today has been such a day. Okay, so we found Pip and we're going to find the magic. And we're going to up our uh, medicinal excellence to a four. We're gonna up our gift giver to a four and we're gonna drop this down to a two and maybe even, yeah, we'll do this in, in preparation. I love medicinal excellence, dude. I'm just a medicinal excellence fiend. I love the amount of things you can pull off with, I just clicked a button too quickly. I just love the amount of like double heals you can get where you normally couldn't. So we're gonna go with this build right here uh, and we might get a little bit more to play around with with the next patch. If we could drop our reload down to a three, we'll see. This allows us to get Kronos two and I think we're just like Gucci, think, I don't know. And then this last one, not pep in the step. We definitely wanna get something along the lines of of. Da, 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 da. You know what? Smithereens actually works out pretty well. Oh man, maybe Smithereens is the play you go to get your, your left click up more often because there's no just basic reload, right? There's movement speed. Ugh. I don't think there's anything else I want. We'll go ahead and go Smithereens. I could save your life one day. Save your life one day. Kind of like shoot, shoot. Oh, I got to reload, but I can right click a target and then like get another heal and then get a potion and then the target lives. We'll say that. Smithereens, here's a loadout. Uh, medicinal Exodus could probably be dropped down to a four or a three, but I think four minimum just for the heals that I want to pull off and five just feels good, man. So on that note, I'm going to head out of here. I hope you enjoyed it. I'll see you next time. Hey, thanks for watching. I'm not going to be one of those people who asks you to like and subscribe, so I'm not going to ask.